Today, Orleans DA Jason Williams finds himself as the subject of a trial facing corruption charges in connection with allegations of tax fraud. Williams was elected while under indictment in 2020. His law partner also facing charges. Eyewitness investigator David Hammer has been following the start of the trial today and joins us live with details on jury selection. Hey there, David. Hey, Mike. Yeah, jury selection started promptly at 9 a.m. They brought in 94 prospective jurors from all across southeast Louisiana. They're about to hear a very important case where the prosecutor has become the prosecuted. Orleans District Attorney Jason Williams and his private law partner Nicole Burdett face 10 felony counts of conspiracy to commit tax fraud, falsifying business expenses totaling $720,000 and failing to report $55,500 in cash. Burdett is also being tried on a separate indictment for filing personal tax returns that claim allegedly false business expenses of more than $280,000. Williams and Burdett run a private defense firm together called Jason Rogers Williams and Associates. Williams says the charges are politically motivated, but he won't be allowed to claim that as a defense at trial. He and Burdett are expected to argue that they detrimentally relied on Henry Timothy, a tax preparer who pled guilty to cheating on his own taxes. Williams sounded relieved and ready as he entered federal court this morning. Anything to say on your way in? I'm glad to stay here. Glad to finally here. Now, Judge Lance Afric is presiding in this case. He's taken over because uh, the original judge in this case, Martin Feldman, passed away. He started by questioning the first 65 prospective jurors, and he's already dismissed two of those jurors. He says the trial is expected to take about two to three weeks, and they will not be meeting on the weekends. Reporting live from downtown New Orleans Federal Court, David Hammer, Eyewitness News. A lot of eyes will be on that one, David. Thanks. And we will have continuing coverage of this trial with more reports tonight at 5 and 6 on our newscasts. And we will have updates on our website as well. Also look out for them on our free smartphone app and our social media pages.